Hey babe, here we are in the last few days of orgasmic alchemy. And where I'm at is that I started this, well, because spirit told me to do it. And, you know, to see what I could alchemize in my life in this condensed amount of time. And it was a lot. And to launch myself into doing this podcast that I've been desiring to do but I have not recorded one podcast two weeks ago I was like oh we need to start immediately and didn't do it so I'm sure there's lots of things to look into there but what what really is a thing that I've been holding is that I don't want to do it alone. Like my, the first time I ever thought about having a podcast and I was like, that sounds like the best job ever. Um, it was the idea of having a continued conversation full of chemistry. And so I desire a co-host and then I started having these visions that the co-host was going to be my romantic partner. And I just loved that idea. Loved it. But as you can see, it's just me here. And so it was like, okay, you got to do it. And, and then he'll come in when he comes in. And but I haven't been excited. So I have a friend who was like, maybe you should date on the podcast since you're going to be talking about, you know, your romantic relationship and dating experiences. Why don't you just, just date on the podcast? And I was like, this is an interesting idea. Like, is it a reality show? Is it a game show? I don't know. I think I would make an excellent host of both. And it looks like I might be. Um, so I'm thinking since I want a co-host and I want a romantic partner, I'm going to make this process coincide. I've put on my dating app that I am looking for a person who wants to have a podcast with me and lead couples relationships retreats with me and that's pretty specific so i think i'm gonna go ahead and do the dating interview process together because if he's someone i want to be with he's gonna want to be on the podcast and if he's someone who wants to be on the podcast and he's someone i'm interested in dating so <laughs> and we'll see what um adventures I have on the way, how quickly this happens, um, which I think has a lot to do with me and how quickly I get myself to actually do the thing and figure out all the little things and figure out how to get Hinge to sponsor me as Spirit told me that was who I should ask to sponsor me in the ecstatic dance I was in on Wednesday night. And I was like, okay, okay. Um, I would love to make this a financially supportive career option, obviously. And let's see, was there anything else? Yeah. If you would be interested in watching slash listening to me dating, interviewing <laughs> the co-host, future romantic life partner, uh, give me a give me a heart, give me a thumbs up, whatever it is where you're at, and um, yeah, look out for that. It's coming at you. <laughs> All right, I'll see you tomorrow.